Dear friends, we have come together to witness and affirm the joining together of Lucizine and Josh into the covenant of marriage. We first met at massage school. It was 2008. We were at orientation and I remember I was sitting down and um, I saw him walk into the room. I just kind of like looked up and I just saw him and I just felt like, you know, something just like took over like my body and I just like knew right then and there like he was on. Good evening. Okay. <laughs> and thank you for joining us tonight in this beautiful celebration of the love between my sister Lucy and my brother-in-law, Josh. I don't think he noticed me right away. No, I always said I didn't, but I absolutely did. Really? <laughs> <laughs> I just didn't want to give you, I just, just didn't want to say that for some reason. <laughs> I think for both of us, when we both started school, we of course thought of like our future, whether it was to, with someone else or just trying to get through and bettering our lives, of course. And uh, but uh, looking back at the day of orientation, I absolutely do remember. <laughs> I absolutely do remember Lucy, and the first thing I I noticed were her eyes, by far. So uh, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Justin Gronowski. I'm Josh's brother, I'm older by about two years. Um, I'm glad that everyone could come out tonight. A lot of new faces, a lot of new family. It's great to see. We um, had our first date at Starbucks. So it was a Friday night. I had just gotten home from work and I was like, maybe I'll call him to see if he wants to grab coffee sometime over the weekend. So I called him and I was like, hey, you sound like you're busy. Is this a good time? I just wanted to see if he wanted to grab some coffee with me. And of course he replied saying yes. I would say just from that point on though, we were almost like inseparable, right? Yeah. Or at least whenever we did have free time, like, like today even, since we have different schedules, it's still, Whenever we have any time together, we definitely cherish it and are very happy. Lucy is older than me by 16 and a half months. Since Lucy is older than I am, her role in our sisterhood was much different and also more difficult. She was thrown into all sorts of situations with little to no guidance, especially since our parents did not grow up in the United States. She remained humble when she found success and persevered when things did not always go as she had hoped. She has always been the most important teacher in my life as I was lucky to be able to watch, learn, and grow from all of her experiences and knowledge that she shared with me. We got engaged on March 27th of 2017. Really remember, I remember. Oh, I was supposed we... to remember the date. <laughs> I remember I was in the kitchen and all I hear is a uh oh and he comes into the kitchen and he has a smile on his face and I'm like what what's wrong and he wouldn't tell me and then he just looked so excited and he was like I can't keep this a secret much longer he's like I just gotta you know go for it and I'm like what are you talking about and he gets down on one knee and he proposes to me in our kitchen and I was so surprised. After waiting as long as I did to finally uh, buy the, her engagement ring that she deserved, and I felt it was uh, a good symbol of our love. I, I think I only had it for at most a month, so I cried. <laughs> so it really came down to I just couldn't wait any longer and went for it. And then she said yes. Josh has gone through a lot of changes in life. And I, I can't say how proud I am of the man you've become today. And I give a lot of the credit to Lucy for kind of taking this misshapen, lumpy piece of clay and uh, really making him a man. And uh, I, I can't be prouder of him. I love you. I have a, a ton of respect for you. I really do. 
I want to say that I love you and I'm looking forward to spending the rest of my life with you and I can't wait to see you down the altar. Um, I've been looking forward to this day since I was a little girl and I just know that it's going to be a, an amazing day because I have you right by my side and you're my best friend. Lucy, I couldn't be happier tomorrow being our wedding day and I just want to promise you from this day forward as well as since the day we first met that you will be my everything and you will always have every small amount of my love that I have to give and all of myself to give you. I'd like to propose a toast to the beautiful union of families today. I'd like to say cheers and que scone, everybody. I love you both so much and I can't believe that I finally have a brother. I would like to welcome everyone to join me in raising a glass and offering a toast to Mr. and Mrs. Josh and Lucy Gronowski. May your faith in each other and the love you share only grow stronger with each passing day and deeper with each passing year. Hi Josh, take you Lucy Zine to be my wife. Hi Lucy Zine, take you Josh to be my husband, my partner in life, and my one true love. I will cherish our union and love you more each day than the day before. I will trust you and respect you, laugh with you, and cry with you, loving you faithfully through good times and bad, regardless of the obstacles we may face together. I give you my hand, my heart, and my love from this day forward for as long as we both shall live. Josh, I give you this ring. Lucy Zine, I give you this ring as a symbol of my vow. With all that I am and all that I have, I honor you in the name of God. You may kiss. Gracious God, pour out the abundance of your blessing upon Lucidine and Josh. Defend them from every enemy and lead them into all peace. May your love for them be a seal upon their hearts, a mantle about their shoulders, and a crown upon their foreheads. Bless them in their work and in their companionship, in their sleeping and in their waking, in their joys and in their sorrows, in their life and in their death. And may peace, your peace, most gracious God, surround them now and each day of their lives. Amen.